year 2020, 2019, 2018, the hospital was not like this. But thereafter, after surviving COVID-19, what we are seeing presently is progress. And I can assure you that uh, we have reason to celebrate. We have our students here, we have our staff here from the junior to senior. And, uh, you know, this is a, a hospital of about a thousand beds. And uh, like I said, 60 years old. We are the only hospital in Nigeria, public hospital, federal teaching hospital, with our own independent, uh, independent power project. They are yes. yes. have a reason to celebrate, don't you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. So the question is when they say there's no light in Nigeria, is loot part of Nigeria? No. <laughs> We also have uh, gotten a lot of support from federal government, the, 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 the support in terms of uh, funding for our teaching hospital in the last two years has been tremendous and I sincerely hope that uh, if it is, uh, that is consistent, in the next five, ten years our hospitals all over the country, they are going to be better. And the question is, you have to give thanks to the, 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 uh, the president, President Mohamed Buhari, the executive of uh, the, his, his, uh, his, his, his team, uh, particularly the executive. And also, we must also not forget the role played by the parliament, the House of, the House of Representatives and the Senate. They have also support the increase in funding for our, for our hospital. We are going to have a 30 bedded ICU, which is going to be the biggest in this part of the world. I think we deserve a round of applause. We have also had a lot of support from uh, NGOs, from club. That building, the building that you are looking at, was donated by Lion Club and the Lion Lushola Dada uh, family. And that, that building is worth uh, more than 350 million dollars. It did deserve, deserve a round of applause. The hair block was, uh, donated, uh, was uh, renovated by Airtel Nigeria, and I'm sure that uh, everybody that enters that uh, uh, um, uh, uh, the building, you see that a lot of uh, a lot of uh, a lot of changes are there. Also, we have a present in Nigeria liquefied natural gas is actually renovating C block. C block is a um, obstetric and gynecology. So I'm, I'm sure before the end of the year we're going to we're going to complete that. And also, I must also say the though she doesn't want us to announce that we have a donation from a kind-hearted Nigerian, a woman. Uh, 60 bedded oncology ward, we call it Alima Ata Oncology Ward. A 60 bedded. That is a, it's going to be a single, a single um, a set of uh, wards, four floors, the biggest in Nigeria, and probably the worst. We have the, the, the and not only that, uh, 